Very cool. So tell us a little bit about this one. 1912. 1912. This is how they rolled in 12, it's, huh? Well. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Henry Ford always said, racing started when we built the second car. <laughs> and he was right. He was absolutely right. So is this an original? Speedster. Yeah. This is an original Speedster then, huh? Yeah. The wow. uh, Ford Motor Company sold, sold accessories for the Model T for people who wanted to go racing. Mm. And you could buy everything that you see on this car. Wow. From the Ford Motor Company. So all the accessories, it the chrome. The large center headlight was for racing at uh, the Vanderbilt Motor Parkway. Very cool. Of course, the deer and other animals. That the Vanderbilt course. Motor Parkway was a right raceway oh, then, yeah. right? Yeah, sure. Hmm. Uh, it, uh, it's got a modified Ford engine. Okay. It's supposed to have 19 horsepower. Hmm. I think this has 26 horsepower. Wow, so it's a which significant a change. And I'll show you the motor. It's a mm. great little motor. Very cool. You guys the car does 50 miles an hour. 50? 50. But the problem is you can't stop it. Oh, yeah. And You're going to need some mountain brakes on here. The gas lanterns in the front, I converted to electric. Mm -hmm. I ran the wires through the gas pipes. Oh, very cool. Oh, I see you got a halogen bulb in there now. Yeah. The uh, side lamps, the mocking lamps mm -hmm. are uh, kerosene. Okay. So oh, they yeah. light up. Oh, very cool. I could see the wick in there. The, uh, what was I going to say? Excuse me, Mike. Sure. Hello. Beautiful brass. Nicely done. I never thought he'd sell this one. Very neat. This is all Henry Ford. All steel. Oh yeah, gas tank is Ford. The mm. uh, wheels are uh, buffalo wire wheels. Mm. I don't know what constitutes a buffalo wire wheel, mm. but there are four of them on the <laughs> five of them on this car. <laughs> Very cool. And uh, everyone says, "Oh, you got buffalo wheels." Don't know what they are. Don't they know look cool. Buffalo, New York, or, or buffalo but for tough. Or? Everyone says buffalo. Great. Oh, very cool. Uh, the uh, brass is all that speedometer set up here. Uh, this was on eBay mm -hmm. uh, two months ago. That for set two thousand dollars, just for that oh my that God. silly setup. Wow! Well, it looks great. And it's an original. Very neat. It's got uh, we converted it to uh, twelve volt. Okay. Take a look at the fittings for the grease on the front. The little cups. Oh, yeah. With the little handles on the top. Yeah, very cool. You twist those handles and it lubricates. Oh, it's almost self lubricating then. Well, no, you gotta twist it. You gotta twist it, but still. Very neat. You know what this needs? Rocky Mountain brakes. That's right. Absolutely. Then you'll be able to stop. Wow, very pretty. Oh yeah. Very nice. You know, I drove from New York to uh, California in the great race on a Model T. Did you really? I did, yeah. What me and my experience. dad. It's awesome. There was 50 of us. Wow. Really cool. Well, you can tell me about Model Ts. Yeah, we had one when we were growing up. It was the first car I ever drove. Very cool. We put a little more dependable carburetor on it. And mm -hmm. Oh, electronic ignition. Uh, you know, yeah. so that it starts and runs. Cool. But it runs, I mean, it's it's been car shows. Sure. People love it, huh? down Long Island. Uh, we never went to Connecticut with it. Mm. Uh, Just local uh, stuff, right? All good stuff. Mm -hmm. Very neat. Runs like a top. Very cool. This gets a lot of attention, I'm sure. Well, guys, thanks for joining us today. Michael Runnels here at Weeby Autos. Feel free to give us a call. We're at 631-339-0399.
You can also check out all of the details on our website about this car, including photos and pricing and everything. It's uh, WeebyAutos.com. Thanks a lot, and uh, hope to hear from you soon.